Welcome once again on K2K30 YouTube channel. The name is Alexis Seva here, and today video is colorful, wonderful, and it is a scrolling WS2812 B 8 bit LEDs. We'll be presenting. If you don't consider subscribe, please subscribe to this channel. If you did it, don't do it again, but hit like and keep enjoying with K2K30. The video of today will be turning around the colorful moment so stay in touch now the 8 bit rgb is ws 12 28 12b is made by this the package you see here you see that it is made by 8 red 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 and on its back it show its pinout you see that it have like the input pin which is ground in vcc and then ground by default those two ground has continued it means they are connected together and then you can cascade or connect together more than these items so that they can make a, a long connection then to interface this we will use we will need Arduino and then we need its cable and then we need some jumper wires like three jumper wires will be enough we will try to connect it to the in to connect them to the inside and then try to control our LED Oh, the circuit connection is demonstrated as that you see that this is the interface for the fritzing software and this is the one which is going to be used to hook up or to make the connection of the arduino and then the component you see there i bring the arduino and then following i bring again the red strip 8 bit ws 12 b WS2812 B you see that it have a full connection which is VCC ground and then input you have two ground of course I first connect the in pin to pin 3 means it will be the data pin for our communication between Arduino and WS2812 B red strip and then I proceed by connecting the ground to ground and then I finish by connecting VCC to plus 5 voltage it means I already finished my circuit and it will be looking like that on breadboard now after finishing all the stuff related to connection let's jump right on the part of programming so we will first open up the program arduino of course it is the only one that you have to use and wait for it to open then boom you see that the arduino is open but by default the program was in but if it is the first for you to run this program you have to install a library that library is called fast read you will go to sketch manage library then wait for manage library to open then after manage library is opened then you have to search for fast read then after finding the the fast read library for for daniel then you have for me you have seen that for me it is already installed so there is no need to install it uh, if it is your first time you have to click there to install then when it is installed it will be looking like that on my screen then after find, finishing with installation you come back to to your main program 
it means in Arduino programming it means in Arduino IDE then you search for you go for file example then go to first read then find the example there and then choose the one which is called uh, Cara Parrot right in the first read you choose there Cara Parrot you will make a little modification depend on the type of your read there the pin it means the data pin was 3 and then the number of red was 8 and leave the other settings as this except that one and the type of our LED strip was WS2812B after doing that then you hit upload it means of course for you if it is the first time also you connect your Arduino to your computer you have to go to tools then choose board and then configure also the COM port during uploading you have to observe that the LEDs on Arduino means transmit and receive so that they bring a little time you can confirm that the upload is done then you start enjoying a beautiful change of color from a programmed WS12 28 12b red strip so you have see that the brightness really is not enough so what you have to to do is to use external power supply and in dark or in a place where there is no light you can expect the wonderful and high bright color like this guys thank you for watching it was alex sevahiri I hope that you do everything possible to stick around the K2K Tech YouTube channel and then all electronic components used in this video can be found on link under description below. It means links under description below. Thank you. Ciao bye.